Luis DeLuca slash staff photographer. Dallas head coach Jason Garrett is pictured on the sidelines during the Green Bay Packers vs. The Dallas Cowboys NFL football game at AT&T Stadium in Arlington, Texas on Sunday, October 8, 2017. Louis DeLuca slash The Dallas Morning News. By SportsDayDFW.com Contact SportsDayDFW.com on Twitter, at SportsDayDFW. Brian Broadus, DallasCowboys.com writer and former NFL personnel man, joined the Shan and RJ show on 105.3 The Fan, KRLDFM to talk all things Dallas Cowboys. Here are some of the highlights. After the times you've been critical of Jason Garrett, why are you choosing to defend him now? Brian brought us, every time I try to fire him, he wins 13 games or he wins 12 games. You guys are two or three years behind me on this whole get Jason Garrett fired thing. I saw what's happening here, and he's clearly on the hot seat. Some of the things every boat is talking about on your station and talking about in the media that should have been discussed two or three years ago, and then he finds a way to win those games and basically shuts me up. I am going to let things take its course, and I am going to see what happens this season, but he clearly has run out of options. It's now time to move forward, and he's going to have basically a new coaching staff, and we'll see if the new coaching staff is really new, or is it guys that are currently on the staff. I am going to give him this year and either he's going to sink or he's going to swim as they say. I said this all along. Garrett wasn't going to get fired, and the coordinators weren't going to get fired. It was going to be the assistant coaches that were under contract, those were the guys that were going to get switched out. I never got the feeling that Jason Garrett was going to get fired, I never got the feeling that Scott Linehan was going to get fired, and I never got the feeling that Rod Marinelli was going to get fired. It was going to be the assistants. Jerry Jones, said it on your show, it's the continuity. He wants to keep the continuity. He wants to be able to say that, okay, when I am building my team, this is what I have. Do you agree with that thinking? Broadus, two years ago I said I don't agree with that thinking, and I still don't. Jones, is the general manager. There's a lot of times he's listening to what we're saying, and he doesn't agree with me right now, I've heard that before. Now you're in a situation where you're either going to get the best of Jason Garrett, or you're going to get the worst, and if you get the worst, then you'll get your wish and a new coach will be here at this time next year. Thoughts on the assistant coaches who are leaving the Cowboys? Broadus, they've made the decision that they want to move on from these guys. I think Wade Wilson, former Cowboys QB coach, is an interesting one. I think he's an underrated evaluator here. I think that when you talk about with Doc Prescott and what he's done, the whole thing about how that process worked out. Mike Fisher, was right, you've got three quarterback coaches on this team. Wade Wilson knows what he's doing. I feel bad for him.